so blurry. Oh, why does my stomach feel so empty? <sighs> Making me gag. <sighs> oh, I can hardly see. <sighs> Who's there? Sh show yourself. Oh. Oh, it's just you. Hi. Do you know what happened? I mean, we were just at that restaurant, weren't we? Did I get, like, date rape drugged or something? No? Oh. Well. At least you brought me back. I can... Uh... Wait. I can... I can't get up. This r rope? Hey, uh, can you can you grab your phone or something? I, I can't see down here to get this rope off. I, I don't know why I'm tied up. Y you tied me up. Well, why would you do that? Was I... Was I wandering? I, I know I tend to do that when I get a little tipsy. I mean... Usually, all you have to do is grab my hand and redirect me, and I'm fine. I... Can you just undo this knot, please? No, I'm afraid I don't completely understand the situation. Can you explain? You drugged my drink, but you said I wasn't date rape drugged. It wasn't? Well, what was it? Oh. Okay. Um. Why would you do that? Really? Okay. Well, um. Then. Why am I tied up? You didn't want me leaving without you. Well, well, I, I won't then. You, you could have just asked. I... Kidnapping. Oh, okay. Great, yeah. Um... Why? Why me? Uh-huh. Uh, okay. Right. So, you believe that you are in love with me, and therefore don't want me to go anywhere without you or do anything without you so your obsession with me um which is frankly quite obvious has grown so much you wish to drug me and keep me in your basement until i fall in love with you is that uh is that your plan what i'm getting at yeah okay um Okay. I mean, I can't really, you know, yell and scream. I know nobody's going to hear me. I'm sure you went through all of the proper precautions of, you know, uh, allowing the basement to be noise-proof and setting up proper insulation and, um, you know, just installing a bathroom down here to where if I, I get your trust to where you can untie me, I'm free to use the restroom if I need to relieve myself, you know? N no. <laughs> well, what do you mean, no? You didn't install a bathroom? And what about electricity? Because it's really dark down here. And you probably can't even see much of what you're doing. You forgot. Uh-huh. Am I? Am I taking this quite well? Um, well, sweetheart, I will have you know 
that if you're going to be using a knot like that, you better be sure to double it because it's actually quite easy to slip out of that one. Um, I would have used one. Uh, I would have used a different knot. Yeah. Yeah, I got out. Oh, it was simple. I've practiced them countless times. Or kidnapping scenarios, of course. Oh, and by the way, that drug you used, it didn't do what you were told it did. In fact, it made me just feel a little high for a little while. Or at least I, how I imagine being high would feel, you know? A little woo, happy. And then after about an hour, it went away. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was so acting that up. I did good, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> you looked scared. Surprised, even. Did, did this shock you? <laughs> well, uh, I guess you didn't expect all of those videos, those murder mysteries and stuff that I've watched. Uh, you didn't expect all those to actually teach me something, did you? Well, surprise! I can free myself from knots. I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Can you get a little closer, please? My legs are still tied and all. Uh-huh. Oh, okay, you you expected me a, to be a bit more nervous, a bit more scared? Well, sweetie, in fact, I'm just glad that you finally decided to act on this. I mean, it was taking you, like, forever. In fact, I thought I was going to have to step in. And as a matter of fact, I just might. Yeah. Here, give me your hand. What? You trust me, don't you? <laughs> See, this is the knot I would have used. Because when you loop it through this way and then you, uh, you flip it around like this. See? Can you see? Are you paying attention? Okay. Uh, yeah. Just hold your fan phone right, like, right here. Okay, now bend your wrist so I can get the other one in there. Like, this is how the video told us to do it, you know? Um, so you put you put the wrist in there like that. Now wiggle around a little bit just so I make sure it's snug. Uh, you want to make sure that there's that little bit of, um, it resists you a little bit. Um, and then you just wrap it around uh, this right here, across this chain like that, and voila! Practically inescapable without a third hand. And unless you have some really weird foot fetish like capable of bending your toes around like a monkey. I don't think you're getting out of there, my love. Sorry. But I'm the crazy one now. You can deny it all you want, but I just tricked you into getting yourself tied up. You really didn't do that good of a job of finding the right drug to use. You did not do your research. I, on the other hand, have planned this for um, a couple months now. I was just waiting for you to finally make a move. I mean, from your recent search history, which, yeah, I tapped into that. You have some very interesting tabs that have been open for quite some time. But we won't talk about those. In fact, I noticed you've been doing a lot of research. You've been watching all kinds of wrong knots. Plus, you're on YouTube, and they never show the really good stuff on YouTube. You've got to go other places for that. I'm sorry, sweetie. Oh, are you beginning to panic? Well, sweet thing. You should have thought this through a little bit sooner. <laughs> You thought you could kidnap me. Oh, you poor dear. Listen, my sweet. There is nothing you have said, done, or looked at in the past few months that I haven't known about. I have access to everything. Go ahead, scream. 
I mean, you did say you didn't reinforce it with anything soundproof, so I guess there is a chance that someone will find you. But even if they do... Who are they going to believe? They're welcome to come down here and search. Because one thing I do know you thought of was how to hide me if you had me. Because you were terrified of getting caught. I, on the other hand, would love to. Because in this scenario, I could claim that you kidnapped me first, which, shocker, you did. And then I could just say I reversed the roles and have been trying to escape this place ever since, but was unsuccessful. All because you wouldn't give me the key. I gotcha. There's nothing you can say or do that I can't counter in this scenario. <laughs> oh, dear. You know, I really wish that sad look on your face had any effect on me. But in fact, I'm kind of glad that you're scared. It means you still have a little bit of humanity left. So, my sweet, how does it feel to be locked in your own basement? <laughs> oh, sweet, sweet irony. I live for it. I'm really surprised you didn't notice until sooner. You know, how do you think you got those drugs in your cupboard in the first place? Yeah. Yeah, sweet thing, that was me. And, uh, you know, just the random rope that was in your garage. That's like tow rope quality. Even if you pulled and pulled and pulled and pulled, you're not going anywhere. You are mine. You are my little plaything. My doll. My yandere. Because that's what you were becoming. Only you didn't know that I was already obsessed with you. And you trying to kidnap me was a threat to my dominance. I have that power. And I utilize it on you. Don't you ever think you can challenge me again. Because it won't work. You will fail time and time again. I've practiced this. No, not with you, because you were my ultimate prize. You I've longed for for two, four years, maybe three. And I am so excited to get to enjoy you now. Don't worry, I know your boundaries and your limits. And although I may test them, I will never break them. I respect you too much. You know, I didn't expect someone like you to decide to do something as crazy as kidnap me. <laughs> it's just not practical for you. Is it? Well, lucky for you, you're not the only one who's obsessed. Because I, I am living a dream right now, seeing you sit there struggling in fear, pain, and so much panic. Oh, it drives me crazy. <laughs> I mean, I know that I am, but to this extent, I didn't think it was possible. And then you threatened me like that. Oh, I just, I had to rub it in your face. I, I had to have you for my own. 
but you've been through a lot, and I'll let you handle it for tonight. Tomorrow is when I really get to have some fun with you. So make sure you rest up and drink that water over there, too. That's a good boy. I'll see you in a little while.